Hey guys, what's going on? Um, I've got another video that I would like to do. Um, I'm currently, I currently have a 15 Silverado, and uh, as you can see, I have all the 14, 15, uh, you know, the uh, the programs for those years. But I wanted to add the uh, the CarPlay, and uh, finally, I was able to find the HMI that is compatible for my truck, and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and install it. And I can give you more details about how to do it. So most of you already know how to, but there's some people that don't know, and that's why I'm doing this video for those people that don't know. Uh, everything is just like this, just the same uh, as any other 1415. And so I'm gonna have the CarPlay with another things that um, that uh, that the 16s and 18s have, such as CarPlay. And then I also did a, a, a an HMI unlock, uh, and I can show you more features once I install it. So here's the the company that I used. Uh, it's White Auto Automotive and Media Services. Um, I I'll put the link for their website, and then uh, but let me go ahead and start removing. We have to take the uh, this. Uh, Glove compartment, the bottom one, because that's where our HMI is. Uh, before I start doing this, uh, some people will do it, other don't. Uh, I'm gonna take the ba the battery, the negative off, and then connect connect the the HMI. And for those that don't know uh, what the HMI look like, here I just got it delivered uh, a couple days ago. There you go. So that's the HMI. So I've already been programmed with my VIN number. Uh, you have to get him programmed to your VIN number. Other than that, he's gonna show like a, a theft lock because he doesn't match your VIN number. So get it programmed uh, through. Uh, uh, white Auto Media, Automotive Services, um, and get it done right. Here's this one uh, that I found on eBay, and then uh, also he recommends to get the radio program, and this is what the radio looks like. Um, that's the one that he recommended for my truck, so. I got this one program as well. Uh, so let me go ahead and get it installed and then I can show you the features that I, that I was able to gain doing this uh, this upgrade. So hang tight. Um, I'm going to go ahead and take it off and I'll show you. Alright so I have my hood open. I really took the battery and plugged it and everything so waiting for the power to drain. Again, remove the glove compartment from the bottom. Uh, there's uh, one and two. There's four screws that are T15s. Uh, you just need to get the the lower one, and then your HMI is going to be right there. See those wires right here? Um, that's the air filter. I need to change that. But uh, but yeah, let me let me get it out, swap it, and then put it back. Cause uh, I'm in Texas and it's a bit hot, so let me swap it out. All right, there's one more thing that I forgot to mention, and it's this outlet. Um, the uh, USB hubs, it needs to be swapped. That's a 15, 14, 15 model or a part, and we have to get this one. It looks like this. This is for the 16 Plus. Silver autos, and here's the part numbers 1350 9442. So let me install this one and uh, I'll turn everything back on and we'll see all the goodies that we gained. All right, I'm gonna turn everything back on.
Moving up. There you go. There are navigation, weather, settings, and the most important one, CarPlay. Apple CarPlay. Let me uh, believe I have to unlock this. That's what we want to see. Oh, on. oh, there you go. Now the upper car play appears in here. There we go. This is the good stuff. Totally worth it, guys. Got Spotify, Waze. Uh, my favorite one, which is Google Maps. Loading up. This is a pretty neat feature. Oh, I have to allow it. Allow on my phone. There it goes. It's not showing up in there because it's not showing on my phone either, so I'm sure that it's booting up right now. There it goes. That's it. So, there you have it. Now my Pandora, if you want, Spotify, Waze, and I'll see if I can get some more apps into it. I think that. This is just what is limited to, but uh, everything is working out. So check them out. It's White Auto and Services, I believe. White Auto Media. I'm sorry, I'm not, I can't even remember right now. Uh, <laughs> I'll uh, I'll put it in the description. It's called WhiteMediaAndServices.com. Uh, so go ahead and check them out. I'll put the description on the link and uh, you guys can get this done yourselves. Again, this is my 14, uh, this is my 15 Silverado and I would have the uh, 16 um, HMI with the program. So yeah, there you have it. So here's some of the features that I was able to gain, which is Apple CarPlay. There it is. And all these apps, one of the things that I'm really excited about and I've done it already uh, was to gain the video. Um, I already have one of the videos on YouTube where I showed you guys how to install a OEM flip down screen for a Silverado. So this is the main one that, that I'm really excited about for my kiddos. I'm going to add that. I still need to change the... Uh, to the DVD player because right now it's just a CD player so I'm gonna swap that and and run the new uh, wires for it but you know this is the one that I'm really excited about so there's other ones right here the camera uh, this one what it does it's not equipped right now so nothing happens I mean it, it, it actually this is what's doing um, I need to send the power for the camera to be on um, while it's not moving so that it can show the screen uh, I've done this again uh, before so I need to run the power back there in the, on the on the harness for the for the camera and that's why it's showing blue right now so but this one it gives you 25 seconds uh, while you're driving to access your rear camera view so if you're pulling a trailer like I do or, or something you know you just want to make sure that your tights down are good or something is you know 
whatever uh, just press that one and it'll it, the screen will come up so it gives you the access to have that that view of the rear camera while you're driving for 25 seconds uh, so those are two main features now I also have the unlock which allows me to play videos um, on on a USB stick which I can put it in here and I can play it uh, and it will be while I'm driving so right now I'm not driving because uh, I'm at home but uh, that's basically uh, what the uh, HMI unlock does so there you go guys I hope you enjoy it and uh, if you guys want to do it feel free to do that I mean that's pretty much it's pretty cool uh, so yeah all right Thanks, yes.